Welcome back, everybody. I'm your host, Kelly Sparks. Hey, gay. Hey, dude. So, today I have my final review of Elijah Craig Barrel Proof Batch Feet. Feet. What is a fee? B519. So, I've actually had this one the least amount of time that I've had Batch A and Batch C but I went through it a lot quicker, uh, mainly because it was easier to drink than the other two. Um, you know, get a last couple drops out of that, yeah. So, in the, in the blind tasting that I did, and I'll see if I can't put a link in the, uh, the video, figure out how to do that. I think I, well, excuse you, come on up, why don't you? Huh? So, I don't believe I actually did a one-off review of this. I just got it and started drinking on it. Uh, but, I found it to be the, the least flavorful of the three in the blind tasting. And it was the mildest as far as heat and dryness. We'll push off of me again and see what happens. Bitch. But standalone, probably. I mean, it's 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 standalone. It's a really good whiskey. But I find that the whiskeys that have a very tame, easy to drink profile don't do well in head-to-head -head competitions. So, by itself, you can feel the heat kick up a little bit. And this one's only bottled at 122, 122.2 uh -huh. 122 proof, 61.1%, I don't know. So by itself, you can feel the heat come on. And uh, it has this very perfume like nose not not super sharp like the Willet product but just maybe a uh, just a just a very minor what, what's the word I'm looking for um, non-invasive type perfume just something that smells good mm -mm. By itself, with no water, you don't really get the astringent notes that you get from like the uh, like I got on the 18 year, that one had a very super sharp, heavily, heavily wooded astringent note. And uh, the Elijah Craig 23 has the same thing. And you can tell that these barrels, in my opinion, and like I said, guys, this is my opinion, but I would say mm -hmm. that about 15 years for my specific tasting notes and my specific flavor, around 15 years depending on where these barrels these specifically the 12 year barrels are aged 15 years is probably max where what it needs to where it needs to sit so i'd love to have a, a 15 year elijah craig i'd like to see that and i know they got the uh they got the 15 year uh old fitzgerald but that's the, the weeded mash bill so Love to come across like a 15 year old Elijah Craig. I was thinking, I was thinking of the other day, I was, uh, what funny blends I could make. And I came up with the Daniel Craig. One part Jack Daniel, one part Elijah Craig. I thought that was funny. 
I don't have a humorous. But I will scouts on her. I will never pass up a batch of Elijah Craig, no matter what, because I think it's one of the more what's the word I'm looking for, Lion. Uh, it's one of the more shit. I can't even think of the word. Anyway, it's a damn good product. <laughs> I'm running low on thoughts. It's one of the more dependable. Maybe that's what I was trying to say. More, it's one of the more dependable barrel proof products that it, it changes from batch to batch. Uh, unlike the Wild Turkey Rare Breed, they're pretty much, they run through this batch and whenever they, they've done that one, then a couple years down the road, they'll change to a different batch, so. Uh, I've found that I like these better. Like I'll, I'll be, I'll quick, I'll pick these up quicker than I will a Booker's release. So I didn't even buy any Booker's for 2019. I just, it's not what I was feeling at the time. Uh, I don't really regret it, but hey, it is what it is. So yeah, that's it. Uh, Logic Craig Barrel Proof, one of the better bourbons, uh, barrel proof bourbons on the shelf, probably. Probably my number two uh, readily steady release. Uh, but yeah, right now, Wild Turkey Rare Brief, we all saw that in the blind tasting. So, Elijah Craig, I think it came in third, maybe, in that blind tasting in the, uh, the one off Four Roses single barrel goody goody pick beat it. So, if we eliminated uh, barrel picks out of the mix, then this would have got second place more more than likely. So that's all I got. Love your crack barrel proof. It's damn good juice. Don't forget to check the description below for all the links to help out with the bills around the house. Uh, like and subscribe, please. There's an applause button that I keep forgetting to mention down at the bottom. You can see it for like an extra two bucks. If you want to show a little more appreciation, click on the applause button. I think it's like two dollars. So that's just one way to help out. Um, also, the Bearded Idiots, check those guys out. They're pretty funny from time to time. We get into we get into deep stuff from ever so often, talk about conspiracies, and then just ramble on into utter idiocy. So that's all I got. Like always, drink some whiskey, share with your friends and family. Be safe, don't drink and drive. Take care. We'll see you next time.